I'm lacking time to sleep. Okay. <laughs> Hi everybody, this is Crossbow Megas. I'm the captain here and I have Leon. Yo! I got them still on the side. Yo, what's up? And today, um... We need to stop doing these mirror matches, like seriously speaking. But no, no, no. Either way, there's a reason why this mirror match exists because this is Gear Chronicle versus Gear Chronicle. So this is sort of plot based, uh, in a way. Am I right? Yeah. That moment yeah. when you say plot and then the sleeve is no, so. <laughs> <laughs> plot intensifies. Plot intensifies. Plot intensifies. <laughs> Those who get it, huh? Anyways, um, yes. Yeah, so uh, as you read in the title, this is um, uh, Chrono Fang, uh, Chrono Fang Tiger versus Chrono Jet Dragon. Yeah. So we'll go straight into the deck profiles, but I'll start with Leon first. Also. Okay. Okay, this deck is the same one that kind of beat me left, right, center from the last video, uh, which I had with JJ. Uh, this is his uh, Chrono Jet Dragon deck. Mm. His deck is more focused towards uh, less of time leaping, but more to the original Chrono Jet Dragon deck that uh, optimized to next stages ability to more on full on aggression. Brief. And... <laughs> Brief. So, we are taking out time. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, so, um, actually, no, JJ played the, the other. Oh, yes, he played the yeah, Time Leap deck, but this is his own personal build of uh, Chrono Jet Dragon. Dragon so which is yeah. very different from yeah. mine. And as for mine, um, this is actually not my deck, as you can tell, these days are not mine, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, mine is somebody more different and such. Anyways, um, no, this is actually uh, our good friend Harlem. You might remember him from the uh, School Idol Festival um, unboxing video. Yeah. And the, and the demo play play. So, um,. This is uh, his. Um, this is actually his own gear corrector which has been modded with the new stuff from GPT-07. So this is a Chrono Fang Tiger deck uh, with um, Bind Time Dragon, um, um, more guards, uh, Gigarin, the new Gigarin, and all that stuff. Try to remember. So um, yes. So um, currently I'm playing Sword because uh, originally this deck actually had uh, Metallica Phoenix, but then. Uh, we've kind of forgot that uh, Metallica Phoenix requires a Chrono Jet Heart, so that's not in here anymore, so we have to go with that. So. Um, anyways, um, that's the deck profile for this one. So if you want to see any of the these two of these deck profiles, you can check the links in the description below for all of the links to uh, our blog that will have our deck profiles for this deck, this deck. You can go there, click the links, and you can see what's in there. So, um, no zombie versus Chrono Dragon next day. So what is this? Battle of the plots, right? Yeah, battle of the plots. <laughs> plot battle. So plot let's see whose plot is, is stronger. So let's get to something. I do not know. Honestly speaking. For so a righteous man for seven times. He dies us again. Yeah. Because the heart tells you so, right? And yeah, I know what I This too, I don't actually watch the vibe. Yeah. Spiritual, yeah, man. Card on the corner. Sorry. <laughs> Not so bad. Yeah. But that's the zombie for you. Uh. Yeah, true. <laughs> you. Okay, ready? Just play by stop. So, so different. <laughs> Cultural differences. <laughs> Cultural differences. Okay, so I can't what you saw, the differences. So I decide I'm gonna go first. Okay, okay ready? Alright, stand up, my so, Vangado. Woo! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, can. <laughs> Draw. Okay. Alright, two. This guy. And then I pull this guy over. Sorry, I don't remember the names currently right now. Sorry. Uh, Steam Fighter Nanya. Nanya! <laughs> Draw. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Again. Again. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Again. <laughs> so Alim. Alim and Chrono Drum to the back. And then I'm gonna attack. No god. Check good. Okay. Alim got it back. Damage check. History make. History make Okay, that's okay. okay. Draw. Ooh, high. Um now I shall write to um this unit which is Gear Taper. Gear Taper. So his skill is big. So this is Alim back. So it's okay. Vagat! No god. Check. I wonder what that implies. Dami, <laughs> check it. Okay. No, 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 you can't plan my skills, I help him build it. So. I know, I know. My sign. That means you're weird too. Sign and draw. <laughs> right. Hold it. Okay, I love good. Okay, I'm gonna the dragon. Yeah, I'll forget. I'm it's gonna do the chrono thing. He always calls this thing and then you just. Yeah. Yeah. No, guys. You're right, guys. Check it. Stand up, three guys. Stand up. Wow. Oh, plus, go set. Okay. Damage check. Nothing. I don't cook. Eep, you bah. Alright, fine. I shall grab five. Got it. Okay, five enough? Actually, no, five not enough. Yeah, five enough. I need ten gig. Okay. Damage check. Okay. Uh, turn over. I'll push me to three, yeah. Ten. And then you're gonna beat me back very, very quickly. <laughs> Quite. <laughs> no, knowing the, the nature of Chrono Fang. Yeah. Speaking of Chrono Fang, right. Chrono Fang, Tiger. 
Corner Fang Tiger Skill, when this unit appears in the Vanguard Circle, uh, I can choose one card from my hand and put it in the Bind Zone. I'll put him. And then uh, if I do, I choose one of my opponent's uh, rear guards, uh, send it to the bottom of the deck, which in this case I will choose Crow. Oh no, I'll choose uh, Twin Mazer. Dragon Show. Twin Mazer. And then after that, he can call uh, a unit from his deck that's uh, two grades lower than the unit that got sent back, so he can call a Bazer. Okay, in this case, I am going to call the. You. That would be helpful to him, so... Mm -hmm. Why are you helping him? You're supposed to create a perfect future! This is a perfect future. Oh, okay. Because he's <laughs> helping me by giving me misery. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so that's all that I'm gonna do, so... I shall attack your banger. No god! Alright, um, drive. First, draw trigger. Plus 5k. Draw. Not that it matters. Second check. Draw trigger. Now that it matters. Draw. <laughs> Damage okay. check it. Oh hi. Hi. He go he went back in time just to get sent into me. <laughs> you know. Okay, yeah. Right then send and draw. This is actually not good. Okay. I I'm not so fortunate I didn't draw any Chrono Jack Dragon, but instead I got Bali. Uh, uh Team Fighter Bali. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I'm gonna strike. Okay, Bali. Mm -hmm. And then uh Let's see you strike to Bali. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to use um, Athletica okay? and then Palif skill but uh, when I perform strike if my heart is not a uh, no it's an X skill it's an X skill but it gives a Vanguard the yes. skill uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I search my deck for Chrono Jet Dragon mm -hmm. and then uh, swap its heart should I use the new one? Which which you it does <laughs> okay. it's immersive it's law friendly yeah, it's more friendly. Okay, cool. Plot friendly. Uh, we 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 talk about emergent scientists. We have our own emergent scientists, and they all said this is immersive. Sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so after that, uh, this card will move to the drop zone. I mean, it's been quite a while. Yeah, so this is the bottom to the bottom of the deck, right? Oh, to the bottom of the deck. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So it moves to the bottom of the deck. So okay. now his heart is corner deck. Yes. So now my heart mm. is corner. My heart. My heart. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> do 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 do. Okay. Call it. Two Mesa. Two Mesa. Okay, <laughs> after that, I'm going to attack you with 16k. Alright, alright. Sorry. Yeah, I forgot about the, yeah, I call the cost for, yes. for Balip, so. Yeah. Attack, this is 16k. Skill, when, this, when GB1, when my when this unit attacks, this card plus 3k. And now it's 16k. Now it's 16k. Yeah. So I need 10k guard, so I shall guard 10k. Okay, and then Metallica Phoenix attacks. Skill, Hazro! Turn over a G unit when this card attacks. And if I have a heart of a Chrono Jet Dragon, I can do so. No, I'm going to turn time walk and then I will time leap Chrono Drone mm -hmm. but one, one thing at a time, time. Yeah. so I go and call a great one Great Oichi okay who am I going to call okay, there's not much choice it's like the Albizer is actually in the same place despite the fact that the mic is reversed yeah yeah <laughs> then, so uh, this is a uh, gear wolf is it gear wolf? Uh, yes this is gear wolf Okay. Gear Hound. Gear Hound. Yeah. Okay. Gear Wolf Something is Gear one. Gear Wolf, isn't it? I think so. Gear Wolf. Yeah, Gear okay. Wolf. Anyway, and then a uh, Chrono Drone skill. When this card is sent to the Bind Zone, because uh, I can uh, move this card into Soul. Then search my deck for a Chrono Jet Dragon and call it to the field. Then I gotta put then at the end, I think it goes to my hand. My hand. Mm. Your hand. Your hand. Your hand. Shit. How about Kurt 26k? 26k hmm. And then at the same time, I'm gonna prop his skill because I'm still attacking Moon the soul. If my Vanguard is a Chrono Jet Dragon I can move this card into soul, plus 5k to the unit and then I draw a card You know what, in that case, I will no guard I will no guard Okay, triple drive Let's check Q, trigger Can I Five. Yes Sorry Jiku wo koete Q, trigger Oh, for the right. Wow. That, that's a bit too early for all this. For GG. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, wow. so damage check. Go away, go away, go away. <laughs> then attack Q from cheap cheap. 21, 28k. Oh, we can see my cards here. Well, um, how much is it? 26k. 28. 28. 28. You wish it was 26. Yeah, I wish it was 26. Then, um, in that case, I will Generation Guard. Oh. Two. I will use the new one, but unfortunately, I cannot use the new one because. That requires a good high but I will use Uluru. Uluru skill. Um, I shall send. Oh, great! I cannot use Uluru skill. So, this is all. 
Oh, so, so I need another 5k more. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 5k more. <laughs> Okay. okay, then my turn ends, then I will dice up. Actually, come to think of it, right? Uluru was used by Yuzu also. Oh, yeah, yeah oh, right. he did Just use once. It. Just once. And then this will go back to my hand, and then this thing will go back to the hand. So, because of time. Yep. Mm. Alright, my All turn. Right, Finally, we meet Kono Jet Dragon. Ting Long Pai Hu. Okay, so. <laughs> Sun 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 Chan. Sure. Sure. <laughs> Yeah. Let's try the this is to prove to those people who consistently think we are Malaysians, we are actually from Singapore. <laughs> <laughs> nice of you to, to put it that way. So. Yes, yes. Okay, in that case, then, um, hmm. Okay, I think I can do it. So I will. Oh, you can't do it. <laughs> I will write, oops, not to you. A bit early. Don't do it. Right, to. Um, buy time dragon, so. Time to. Buy yourself some time instead of buying the Yeah, <laughs> leave the funds to me dude. The time's up! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so then uh, I'm just gonna call um, this unit here. Okay. I made a mistake in terms of my calling, but oh well, let me see what I can pull for my butt. Okay? Wow! Let me see what I can pull for my butt. Just... Nature is calling you. Yeah, nature is calling me. <laughs> so. What I'm gonna do now is that I'm gonna use. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna use this unit skill uh, from the bind zone. Um, what I need to do is pay the cost, which is rest one of my regards, and after I can call this unit to regard circle, and for the turn this unit plus forty. Okay. Right. So I call it here. Right. Then from there I shall go into my attack phase. I guess. Um, attack phase. Attack phase. Yes, indeed. So um, I will take you straight with bind time dragon. Fighter Dragon give me two skill. Uh, when this unit uh, attacks, I can. Sorry if I'm reading it up like this. So I, I will call Blast 2. So Blast 1. Okay. And then I need to flip one Fine Time Dragon over. So. Time to Plus. find some time. Alright. A, A. So A, A indeed. So. <laughs> okay. Then uh, I'll send uh, one of my rear guards and put it to the Bind Zone. I believe any rear guard, right? Um. Yeah, choose one of my rear guards, send it to the bind zone. Then for the turn, this unit plus 10k, one critical. So that's um um 20, 36k right now. 36k plus one critical. Yeah, not nice. Not nice, plus 10k. Thank you. Not very cool. Much. Not, not cool, bruh. Cool, then for ev okay, then the second part of the skill, when for every um unit that I have in my bind zone, my I send one of my opponents regards to the bottom of that. No, I'm all alone. Okay. Yes, <laughs> you're all alone and such. And then, um, then if my heart is a gear beast, which is qualified tiger for sure, I can counter charge two, and soul charge two. This is some very nasty. Skill. One. Yep. Two. Oh, oh nice. Nice. What did you just do? Send these two. Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. <laughs> What's another do? So what are you gonna do? This is the no god. Oh. Like a true plot. <laughs> Sorry. Let's see if your plot is stronger. Triple drive first. Turn trigger. Good. But five k. There's no ten. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Second no check. Third check. Nothing. Apparently your plot is not strong enough. Critical trigger. Kong Kao will the bunker only. Check. Critical trigger. Kong Kao will the bunker. Oi oi oi. Plot armor too strong. <laughs> okay. Then, um, in that case, then I shall attack your Vanguard. How much is that? 5k guard. This is 11, 20, 20, 25. So, 5k guard. Pop, pop. This hand's not very copy and I have to guard it. Okay, can. So, let me put my dice out and strike up. Okay. Turn and. My turn. Stand and draw. Strike the generation. Mm hmm. Into. Chrono Dragon next stage! Oh, I see you found it from the Trading Sage, eh? Yep, yep. <laughs> because Thank you, Trading Sage! <laughs> and uh, uh, this is a... Uh, Hashtag not sponsored. Uh, not sponsored. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I am not gonna pop a uh, Chrono Jet skill. Instead, uh, I'm going to call a uh, Twin Mazer. Right? Twin Mazer? Mm -hmm. Twin Mazer. I'm gonna call a... Uh, that unit. Glimmer Breath. Glimmer Breath. Counter Blast 1. Soul Blast 1. And then I'm going to send a unit that's grade 2 and below back to the bottom of your deck. In this case, you. Okay. And he plus 2k on his own, right? And then plus 2k on his own. That's provided if my Venga is a Chrono Jet. Right? So, mm. Which it is. Yep, so. so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna start poking very hard. Let's see what the Sage has given you. 
Okay, I'm going to uh Oh this is how I can use. Okay. okay, uh I'm going to attack you with a uh, trophy. Skill, same thing, plus 3k when this card attacks Vanguard. Okay. Um Yeah, I'll take that, damage check. Manly. Very manly. Then I'll attack you in next stage. You mean old manly? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> next stage is 26k. Yes. So, um Wow, this is gonna be tricky. Um that's 21. 21. 31 That's, that's one, one. Oh dear, wait, I realized something J Guardian! No, I cannot J Guardian, that's the thing Okay, 31 31 One, one trigger Actually, oh. two triggers Right, I got it <laughs> I see <laughs> Triple drive First check Second Last Blank mm -hmm. Then use uh, next stage as skill uh, Last one uh, turn, uh, next stage over. Mm-hmm. Two. <laughs> What's more, the, uh, the verbal effects. <laughs> okay. Then it goes back to the project, and then you drop three. Yep. From my hand. In this case, uh... Drop the three they just got. You? No. <laughs> <laughs> you wish. Okay, drop all the PGs, right? Drop one away. Right? Drop, drop one away. See? One sure. out of three. That's good enough. <laughs> you want to drop second one, too. Uh, no, no, no. I'm gonna drop the second one. Drop the PG, lah. No. <laughs> uh, thank you for 16k. 16k and it gets uh, the yes. skill is that um, plus 5k and then you cannot guard with a uh, great one and a uh, buff. Great one and a buff. So 16k. This is one, one, one. Since we're talking about plot armor now, let's see how strong it really is. Twin drive. Get to stand on the trigger. Conquer with the bang gun. Then second check. Second check. Critical trigger. Wow. Strong! It's chrono, so... <laughs> Critical? Five. Okay, let me check. Nothing. Oh, oh. Six damage. But, but that was actually quite uh, in, uh, tricky for me for a moment. Yeah, I already left this yeah. much. So even with the mass draw triggers, I drew my, 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 my triggers. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, even with my draw triggers, I drew my triggers. So that really didn't help me. As much and as then so. this is my remaining hand after uh, next stage uh, skill. Actually, I have no more cards to reinforce because it keeps sending things away. Mm -hmm. And then one time, uh, they put me in a spot, despite that I was at uh, 2 damage only. Mm -hmm. But whether I should guard that or not, right, um, was quite crucial. Because if I don't guard it, if it crits me, I'll be sent to the corner very quickly and my hands are not very aggressive to yep. use. So well, I, I need to choose the cards and wisely that how I'm going to guard and how I'm going to attack from this point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh... And Chrono Fang has proven to be a very threatening card very quickly, despite that his skill is so simple but yet so destructive. It's very um, It's the staple of Gear Corner, yeah. I mean, yeah. So it, it should it synergize better with supports, uh, which right now it doesn't get a lot of. So it's but understandable, it, it's very unstable. But right? what it has actually is more than enough. Uh, so and in terms uh, of uh, yeah. Chrono Fang Tiger, mm -hmm. Chrono Fang Tiger he didn't get a lot of boosts in this yeah. um uh, in GBT 07, but it is enough for you to do something because the idea with Chrono yeah. uh, Fang Tiger is um, at, at least the way that I would play it is to wipe my entire field, uh, wipe my first entire field, so it goes straight to the bottom of the deck. Yeah. And then after that, just leave him to stand alone, quite empty on his own. So, mm -hmm. And then uh, from there, it's just a matter of um, well, just getting cards into the bind zone and then sending cards to the bind zone that you can actually call back from the bind zone. Correct. So, stuff like, um, like this one was one, and then my grade two, the one that you sent back to the bottom of the deck, yeah, this was another as well. I can actually call it for the bind zone. So, these are my target cards that I want to use uh, to. to Send to yep. the bind zone so that I can bring them back. Um, but there's not a lot of cards that actually has a, has that. So uh, at least in GPT 07 currently right now. Yep. So, but the only way other to rack up the the, the cards that I need to send my opponent's cards to the deck is through timely. So mm. you have to play timely with this. And there's a lot of cards here that they actually focus on. This is also why Miojin at the moment only uses this handful of cards. And the yeah. fight never finishes because his deck is uncomplete. Oh, sorry lah. How convenient. How convenient. Sorry writing eh. Right? I know, it's just sorry writing <laughs> Oh, this is not funny at all. This is uh, not funny at all. Ouch. Ouch. Time's up for you. Time's up for you indeed, so. Ever get that feeling of deja vu? <laughs> this is not deja vu, this is um, mess with you. You catch my drift. Yeah. <laughs> But anyways, um, yes, uh, there's a lot of potential in a Kodo Fang Tiger deck and those that really play Kodo Fang Tiger should look forward to f future boosts, I would say. Because I suggest, there, will, there will for sure be future boosts. Yeah. Yeah, I would suggest that you keep the deck, even though it's not good now, but because eventually the, the boost will keep. It will yeah. get good later. After all, it is the villain deck, Kodo uh, yeah. Fang Tiger. You can imagine 
um, all the rest of the the, the zodiac time beast to actually come out sooner or later. So we have to see what we, we've seen. We've seen uh, potentially uh, Chronobit Buffalo. Uh -huh. So that will come out on its own. Whether it's a great two, I'm guessing it's a great two. Uh, just a speculation of my side. Yeah. But if it's a great three, then I'm gonna say yeah. Yeah la. So other than that, um, just uh, if you're playing this deck, look forward to the boost that you have. They might come out good. So mm -hmm. that's what yeah. we have to say. So because currently this phase is actually pretty good. It's just rather. Specific to that one combo. Yeah, right? correct, correct. Mm -hmm. Which is like it could kill itself quite yeah, hard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no I wish I could use the new uh, G Guardian, but unfortunately I didn't have a, a great one one uh, on my field to actually uh, pull off the skill. Otherwise, I wouldn't mm. be able to get that. Oh right, his GB two. What does it do again? Uh, his GB two skill is um uh, while you're paying the cost for stripe, uh the the card that you send to uh, the cards will get plus three grain. But then those cards will get sent to the bind zone instead. Ah, so yeah, this is where the uh, GB2 will kick in. Mm -hmm. It's quite similar to what uh, Buster Dark uh, Diablo. Oh, yes, but yes. Right, his skill uh, contributes to his own ability while Buster Dark Buster Diablo, Diablo is like, just trying to get out of yeah. uh, the ditch. So mm -hmm. Exactly, so yeah, that's a uh, Chrono Fang Tiger for you. So yep. it'll, it'll get good soon. So. Plot armor. Get good armor. Get wrecked. Yeah, so uh, apparently <laughs> in, the, in the plot, as as protagonist, as the stories will go, the protagonist always wins. So wow, tag. So protagonist, <laughs> Chrono Jet Dragon wins. Antagonist loses at least for now. So for now, we'll see how it goes in the future. Push. All right. Yeah. So that's all that we have for you today for this fight. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoy what you see with the Gear Chronicles. Um, um, if you like the stuff that you see uh, here, our cut fights, our shenanigans, all sorts of, of funny, funny jokes and references and all that other stuff. Thank you, Trading Sage. Yeah. <laughs> uh, do consider subscribing to us here at Crossbow Vanguard uh, to check out all our videos and uh, check the, the playlist in the description below. That will take you to all of our car fights that we've done so far. This is um, one of the many that we've done so far, and we're coming closer and closer to uh, season three, I believe. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, we should be coming closer and closer to season three from that. So, um, as well as if you want to see um, uh, when our videos are coming up, you can follow us on all of our socials. We're on Facebook at Crossbow Vanguards. We're on Twitter at Crossbow VGS. And also, um, like I said in the, at the start of the video, uh, you can actually uh, head to our blog at Crossbow Vanguards at WordPress.com. There you'll be able to see the deck profiles of these two decks. So if you want to see what's in this deck, if you want to see what's in this deck, you can head over to our blog, crossbowmagas.com, you can check out what's there. You can check all the links in the description below, they lead you to all of our socials. Uh, at the same time also, what you see in our uh, description box below is our Patreon page as well. So if you want to see these, uh, if you want to get your hands on these mats, if you want to see our videos early, uh, do consider uh, supporting us on Patreon. Um, there's perks in there that's just as much for you guys as it is for us. So uh, we want to give back to you guys for all of your support that you've given us so far for this channel. Um, so in that case, that's all they have to say. So um, while, while Chrono John is dancing over the fact that he beat Chrono Fang Tiger, so um, with that same thing, guys, <laughs> again for watching, and see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.